here it comes. It is starting to crack. The chrysalis open. Hopefully you can see that. It's starting to crack. I'm going to try to set my elbow down and hold the camera still. This is pretty awesome. see it starting to crack. The butterfly is going to try to pull itself out. Here it comes. This is September 27th, 2016, by the way. It has to fight pretty hard to get out. See those tiny wings. It's got to free itself. Its abdomen is going to be full of fluid and the wings are going to be very tiny. And in about 15 minutes you're going to see those wings go to full size. But it won't be ready to fly for several hours. the abdomen and the little wings coming out. See the tongue? It's in two pieces. It has to join the tongue together. It's a process of its own. See the tiny wings are going to grow so rapidly. They are already growing. This one looks like a boy, from what I can tell. I'll know better when it's got the wings full size, but the males have a, it's kind of like a little pouch or sack on the lower wing that's more visible on the top side of the wing. It looks like a black dot. But I think I'm seeing that on this one, right on a black vein. It's like the third vein from the bottom of the wing. The little they kind of wiggle back and forth as you're seeing. And the wings are growing. The abdomen's pretty big still, you can see it there. It'll be long and skinny when he's all done. again.
six minutes into this and wings have a ways to go yet, but you can just see they're already a lot bigger. Hard to believe he fit into that chrysalis, isn't it? I think I'm going to name him John after a, a boy that I met this summer in Czech Republic on a mission trip. He was the cutest boy. Um, tried really hard to communicate with me. Um, and we just, we really were fond of each other in the short time I was there. Hope to see him again next summer. So this will be John. I can tell it is a boy for sure. You can see on the wing right there that little thickening in that one vein the little bump looking thing that's the male's dot when it opens it up on the other side get those wings are getting bigger We found these eggs right at the beginning of September. Um, pretty late, we don't usually find them past the middle of August, but we've had a very long, hot summer, so they laid a little later than usual. And um, so this butterfly will be a migrating butterfly. It will not breed on right now. It will instead fly to Mexico um, overwinter in a area in the mountains there and then about January or February the butterflies will start to breed they will die but their children and grandchildren will fly back up to Michigan so this one's going to be leaving uh, Sterling Heights Michigan probably later today or tomorrow um, which is just north of Detroit probably about eight miles north of the city border, ten, eight to ten miles um, in Sterling Heights, Michigan. So we'll put a tag on him for Monarch Watch. It will have an ID number specific to him. We'll record the day, September 27th, um, that we raised this from an egg to a caterpillar. This is a raised butterfly. And um, that we released it here on this day and that it's a male. And we'll give it a name. So he's already named John. We like to name our butterflies. His wings are probably about two thirds the right size now. They got a little ways to go yet. And we're about 10 minutes into this and my hands are getting tired. is strong. You can see how soft those wings are in the wind. They just kind of bend. Um, they will harden up over the course of a couple of hours, but right now they are so soft. Um, you can see they just flap in the wind. I'll turn them a little. There we go. It's getting all blown here. Uh, there, we'll go like that. That might help. I may have to take them back in the house. Um, and you can see those wings now are almost full size. That's just about where they need to be. 
and then he will, um, sorry about that, um, probably in about two, three hours be ready to fly. Pretty awesome, isn't it? See the chrysalis behind? That's what he just came out of, so you can see how much bigger his wings are now. Beautiful. They're just they're just about full size. And then they'll harden. Okay, so I'm gonna stop this video now and just take them in out of the wind. Um, maybe I'll do another video uh, just to show you him once he's ready to go with the tag on. It's about four o'clock. Um, if it gets to be about seven and he's not ready yet, I'll probably just cover it over so it gets dark and he'll roost for the night and let him go tomorrow. But his wings are now about full size. You can see they're already getting a little bit stronger, but he's got a ways to go.